Hi, boys and girls. Happy Monday. We have a very short but busy week. It is a very special week here at Tracy. We have Thanksgiving coming up on Thursday. And this is the week that I like to take time and reflect of how thankful we all should be for we are blessed with so many things. I know I'm thankful for you. I'm thankful for my friends and family here at Tracy and beyond. This week, we're gonna take some time to think about things we're thankful for. So start thinking. In the meantime, stand and please help me say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day and remain standing because Mrs. Ringel will be right on. Hey Cubs, happy Monday. I know, it's a little bit wet outside, but that's okay. Remember, you can always make your own weather on the inside. Let's do our Tracy pledge. Tracy Cubs strive to be safe, be respectful, be responsible as they leave their print on the world because good character looks the same in all languages. Boys and girls, today you're in for a really special treat. Do you remember last week when we finally found Mrs. Montero snuggled up under her desk with a really great book? Well, today's guest is Vicki Otis from the library. She's a librarian. Let's listen as she reads us a wonderful poem. Have a great day, boys and girls. Hi, everybody. My name is Vicki Otis. I am so excited to be your guest reader today. I am a librarian at the Norwalk Public Library right down the street. In fact, some of you have probably been to visit me here, although unfortunately not recently. I am also the proud mom of Addie Otis, a fellow student at Tracy. So I just wanted to read you today a short poem from a book called the Underwear Salesman. The poems are by J. Patrick Lewis. Now this poem here is called Librarian. And there she is, like me. No one has more fun than I. I've met Harriet the Spy, Ferdinand the Bull, and Pooh. Eeyore says, how do you do? Mole and Badger, Toad and Rat, come to dine and stay to chat. With the little prince in hand, Alice in her wonderland. Call of the wild, a petted greed. What else could anybody need? Fables, folk tales, nonsense verse. I carry home in my big purse. Have as much fun by yourself. Take a book down from the shelf. That is called Librarian. There's a picture of the librarian in this poetry book. Um, I want to thank you all and let you know that the library, while it is not opened for you to come in and visit us, we are checking out books and you can use your student IDs as library cards. I'm going to send along information on that. Have a great day, everyone. Bye. Good morning, Tracy Magnet School. I'm here with your weekend and your Monday, November 23rd birthdays. Over the weekend, Cecilia Millian Rodriguez celebrated her birthday on Sunday, November 22nd. Today we have one cub celebrating a birthday, Mason Sierra. We wish both of you a great day and happy birthday. Good morning, Tracy Cubs, and happy Monday. Well, we are gonna have rain throughout the day today. As you can see, it's already starting to come down and it's accumulating on my screen there. We are gonna have a high of 55 and a low of 37, so you're definitely gonna need to dress a little bit more warmer than usual, and also definitely get the umbrella and the raincoat ready. But it's still gonna be a great day, Tracy Cubs. Good morning, I have a weekend story for you. I was doing some yard work this weekend and normally I don't mind it, but this yard work was not very fun. I was lifting lots of wet and heavy leaves out of a small brook that runs through our backyard. It was really hard. And at one point my son Ryan said, wow, mom, you are really strong. I chuckled to myself and I said, well, sometimes it's not always strength in your muscles, it's strength in your mind. Telling yourself that you can do it if you just put your mind to it 
because mommy doesn't really want to do this right now. And it is kind of hard. And he said to me, like our print? And I chuckled again and I said, yes, just like that. Perseverance specifically. So friends, if you're having trouble with a task today, just think of Mrs. Penta lifting those heavy, wet, yucky leaves out of her yard. And I'm sure you will find the same perseverance that I did and get the job done. What? Oh, Mickey? Yeah, no Disney message today, but I mean, who wouldn't want to start their week with Mickey and a little Disney magic? So have a great day.